Copper is actually widely used in electrical transmission lines, especially for smaller scale applications like within buildings or for short distance power transmission. However, it's less common in long distance, high voltage transmission lines for a few reasons. Cost Copper is relatively expensive compared to other materials used in transmission lines like aluminum or steel. Given the large amount of material needed for long distance lines, cost becomes a significant factor. Weight Copper is heavier than alternatives like aluminum. For long distance transmission lines, weight can be a limiting factor due to the need for sturdy support structures. Aluminum being lighter, is often preferred for these applications as it reduces the strain on support towers. Conductivity While copper has excellent electrical conductivity, aluminum is not too far behind and is significantly cheaper. Additionally, aluminum has a lower density, which means it can carry the same amount of current with less weight. Corrosion Copper can be prone to corrosion in certain environments, which could affect the longevity of the transmission lines. Aluminum tends to be more resistant to corrosion, especially when properly coated. Availability Aluminum is more abundant and easier to source globally compared to copper, making it a more practical choice for large scale transmission projects. In summary, while copper possesses excellent electrical conductivity and is suitable for certain transmission line applications, factors such as cost, weight, conductivity, corrosion resistance, and environmental impact often make aluminum a more practical choice for longer distance transmission lines.